Dr. Lick, needless to say, it's exciting just to have you here tonight. Being a part of Tracy Ham's induction, I know it's special for you also. It really is. When, uh, when they called and said, hey, this is going to happen, we just had to be here. He was, he was the man, the, the football player who just let us explode on the scene. And, and we began to bring all these other good people in. And of course, Oak Russell was the best coach in the country. When you decided to start football at Georgia Southern, you never dreamed all the things that were going to happen actually happened, did you? No, not really. And you know, it's interesting. Early on in my career at Georgia Southern, we had 6,200 students when I first went there, and they kept saying, you're going to lose students. You're not going to gain students. You're going to lose students. And then we put in football, and the whole world turned upside down because of the great leadership of our people, particularly the football coach. And what happened is our band kids, our, our music kids, doubled in one year. The SAT scores went up. Everything continued to boom, and who would have ever believed we would be over 20,000 at this point in time in terms of students? That's right. Uh, just to catch people up in Statesboro, is to, you're still living in Tallahassee now? Yes, we're still in Tallahassee. We, uh, we've been there for about 20 years. Uh, after the presidency at uh, Florida State, I stayed on the faculty as a senior faculty member, and I retired three and a half years ago. Still doing a lot of that kind of stuff, but. Uh, but I did retire from the FSU. Morris, needless to say, it's an exciting night being here for Tracy. And a lot of people may not remember how involved you were at the beginning, but I know how excited you are for him tonight. I am. I tell you, when uh, Tracy called me concerning this, I told him how proud and how honored I was. And, and Nate has just brought back thoughts to me that that was one of our main purposes for getting football at Georgia Southern, to have great athletes like Tracy Hand, and we have several others. And I have followed the program the last few years with Coach Jeff, yeah. and I'm telling you, I think we're on the right track again, and uh, I'm just so proud for uh, Tracy. Well, those of us that were involved, like myself, I know how much time, effort, and money you personally put up for the program then. But even then, when it all started, none of us, I don't think, could visualize what was going to happen in the next few years. Well, I know I didn't at, at one time, but other than that, I had no doubt where the program would go. And if I had one more wish, I wish we had gone to A ball. <laughs> I really feel like that Georgia Southern's got a program that would be in the top 20 every year. Well, I know you were influential also with Earth being there, and, and you and Dr. Lick, of course, and Earth and Tracy. It just seems like it was kind of the combination that made it all happen back in the 80s there. Yes, it. Uh, it I'm getting old now, Nate, and it's hard for me to remember all those things, but with the program, the guidance that Eric did for the, some of those boys that didn't have the ability, he brought it, the ability out of each one of them, as he did with Tracy. 